All right, so another week has gone by. You know, we've been busy at work. Training's going well. I was actually out on Wednesday night, and I had put my 50 million layers on, and I was out there for a run. I got out for about 10 minutes, and then had to take a bunch of layers off because it was about 16 degrees. All I needed was shorts and a long sleeve shirt. It was great. And then when I went out for my run today, I was out there and it was just so cold. My face was freezing. So it's amazing how the temperature could vary, but winter is definitely coming. I was out driving today and there was some snow on the ground and making it difficult to drive, but you know, that's the way it is. Got to ride inside on the trainer because I go to work in the dark, I come home in the dark, and you know, there's no real light to be outside in during the week, so I'm on the trainer, and another thing, I've decided to sell my baby. No, not my child, because I don't have one, but my bike. It's a Trek 5200, it's about five years old, and four or five years old, and basically, handmade in Wisconsin, carbon fiber, it's a size 56 frame, as you can see, Trek 5200 here with the Bont Roger race light wheels. It has Altegra components with the exception of a Durace bottom bracket. It has a Sele San Marco era saddle. It also has profile design aero bars and as well the Shimano. pedals, the PD-600s, and as I said, it's a Trek 5200, carbon fiber, and the frame size is 56. Now the price that I'm looking at is $900,000, or if you have a better offer, let me know. You can always send me an email, kevin at dosmithy.com or the contact page on my website also has you can reach me there right, with my email and everything like that now the cycle ops trainer and the uh, stand are not included and neither are the water bottles but there will be two water bottle cages in it as well let me know what you think if anyone is interested I'd be happy to entertain any ideas as I said nine hundred a thousand dollars is the price range I'm looking for. If you have a better offer, you know, let me know. If you have any questions, let me know. As I said, handmade in Wisconsin, so the quality is excellent. It's not another one of those bikes brought over from Taiwan or anything like that. And it's done me very well. I've ridden it in Australia. I've ridden it in Portugal, France, Belgium, Switzerland, Spain, and it's been a great ride so so basically that's what I've been up to if you're interested in the bike let me know I'd be happy to help you out and um, answer any questions that you may have so give me a shout and we'll talk to you later thanks for watching